Hi guys! Hey, what's up? It's Sam Corker and I am back and it's been a little while. So, it's been like two weeks since I uploaded my last video and I'm so sorry. Um, I just started a new gym and it's kicking my tail and I just started a new job and it's a little hard to maintain a new job at a new gym that needs you to come like five to six times a week and to meal prep and to eat clean and to do all these things so that's been a little hard but I'm back and today's video is a what's in my January ipsy bag so I just got my January ipsy bag I will tell you I peaked so I know what's in here but I'm super excited to tell you what's in here and um we're gonna get started okay okay um so I will tell you I don't know what the wind's gonna do right now it is in the middle of the Virginia blizzard um we have about two feet of snow outside um it's snowing still I don't know if my dogs are gonna make it this year um to go to the bathroom we might just have to let them all go inside it's gonna be great it's great fun we've been like shoveling all day well by we I mean my father but it, we're just gonna open up this Ipsy bag and see what's inside okay so this is the Ipsy bag the card says Ipsy all all eyes on you it's just a card with eyes and says you're a knockout keep your eyes on the prize or must have products to prettyfy your peepers like the bombs cult fave eyeliner to on the go beauty essentials January is all about a serious standout look and then it tells you about how to win a free ipsy bag for a year and then the ipsy bag of this month is just this eye covered bag and I think I'm going to use this eye bag to put a pair of sunglasses in and keep that on my purse because I feel like that's what this one's more for. I don't know. I just feel like it's not as much like a cute makeup bag that I'm going to carry on. The other one from last month, which is my first Ipsy bag, I've been keeping my lip products in. So let's go ahead and dive into this bag. So the first product that I have, which that's my phone. The first product that I have is a Promise Organic Ultra Moisturizing Argan Cream Facial Lotion with Olive Oil for Normal to Dry Skin. And... This is paraben free, um, it has Moroccan argan oil and olive oil and it's for deeply um, moisturizing and replenishing your skin. Um, I used this just the other day for some dry patches on my skin and I will say I was like out in the cold, in the rain, pushing carts at my new job and this saved my skin. It was wonderful, saved it, made me look better the next day, beautiful, loved this. And then the next product I have is the Tucker Ashley Advanced Peptide Eye Complex, which this just has the directions and it says apply underneath eye area one to two times daily, avoiding into the eye. This really doesn't tell me much about the product, so I will do a little bit of research on it. I've never really gotten into eye creams. I have one that goes with my like skincare that's just to like like wake up your eyes, but I've never really had one to like do anything funky with your eyes so I don't know what this is really gonna do but I want to look into it I'm only 23 so it's not like I have like intense wrinkles or anything under my eyes but I feel like it's something that I need to prepare for now so that I'm not like 50 and wishing I had better eyes you know so this is kind of cool I'll be using this this month and tell you how I like it but um I don't know next in here is this Blinkle Shimmer Eyeshadow in the shade 102 tangerine light and I don't know if I don't know if you can tell from the shadow but this is this like orangey copper color and I don't know if you can tell by my eyes but they're blue and I feel like this color is going to like make them pop but also make me look like a zombie so I feel like I'm going to use this very sparingly if at all. I don't know if this is something that I'm really going to reach for in my makeup collection. It might be something cool to use around Halloween, but I don't know if this is something that I'm going to just like use. I'll, let me check and see. I don't think I used any to check out color payoff or anything. Let's see. What's your pigmentation, buddy? Let's see. And like the pigmentation for this is like insanity insanity like that was one stroke that's a mess and it's all over my hands now let's just rub this on the sweatpants I'm still currently wearing because it's a snow day okay so 
that might just go a little bit too crazy for my eyes. I don't know if this is something that I'm going to keep in my collection. I might give it away to someone who's a little bit more daring than I am. But I'm pretty conservative in my makeup. So we might just save that for Halloween. Next, which is their Rave About product for the month. And I think everyone got some sort of shade of this in their bag. Is the Mr. Right, R-I-T-E, now eyeliner from The Balm, which I actually used an eyeshadow palette from The Balm that I adore. I'm wearing it on my eyes today, and it's um, The Balm with the Bodybuilder Mascara. I don't remember what it's called right now, but I used it in my um, everyday makeup routine. But I got the eyeliner in Jack, which is just this olive -y brown color, which I think will be really pretty. I'm sure I'll be using a lot of this. And they give you a pretty fair amount. Like, I think this is a full size. So pretty excited about that. This is definitely something that I'll be using on days when I don't want to wear eyeshadow. But I want a little bit of liner on the bottom. So I do like good amounts of liner. So that's exciting. And, like, you definitely shouldn't wear these two colors together. That's things we learned. Little beauty things Sam learns. Um, and then the last and final product that I have in my Ipsy bag is this Peak Espresso Natural Stain Brown Brow Powder, which is this light espresso color, let's see, light espresso color brow powder, <laughs> light espresso color brow powder. It just comes in this really cute tin, and I will definitely be using this. I use the Maybelline Brow Duo and like a Maybelline brow pencil but I haven't really used any like brow powders other than like an elf brow powder so I haven't used anything high-end so that'll be really nice to dive into a high-end brow product and see how that goes but overall I'd say I rate this bag like a five and a half maybe a six um, I just feel like they need to give you some kind of card that tells you what's in the bag I don't feel like this was a bad bag Last month's bag I was a little bit more excited for because it was my first Ipsy bag and I got like a hair treatment, I got a hair mask that I'm still using, I still love it. I used it last night and my hair looks so shiny and so nice um, and like the moisturizer that I used for that was so much nicer. That is the entirety of that moisturizer. Um, but I will say I'm excited for the eyeliner, I'm excited for the brow product. I like the moisturizer, but I'm really just not excited for the eyeshadow or really the eye treatment, and the bag is just not as cute as I would have liked. So there's that. Um, but that's really my review of my Ipsy bag for January. I am excited for February's bag, which I usually get in the middle of February toward the end of February. So be sure to subscribe if you want to see more of my review of my Ipsy bag. Um... I really think that's all I've got for you today. I will have another video up by the end of this week because I definitely owe you another one. Um, thank you so much for watching and I love you guys so, so, so much. Thank you so much for subscribing. And I'm so excited to see that I'm over almost like 125 subscribers. So cool, so amazing. Okay, I'm rambling now, but I wanted to say a huge thank you for all of you who've been supporting me and keeping this channel growing and I'm just I'm in love with making YouTube videos and I want this to just be this really fun hobby that I'm enjoying you guys are all beautiful and wonderful and so positive and so great to me and I just love coming onto YouTube and seeing your kind words I love you guys from the bottom of my heart and you make me so so happy and I'm praying for you all I love you from just every fiber of my being and I hope you know that's genuine <sighs> okay I think I'm done I will talk to you guys really soon. Bye guys. Go back, please enjoy your party out.